welcome back to the channel and if you're new here thanks for joining me today I am bringing you a new series it is going to be called the single sim challenge and I just am starting out here showing you what the house looks like so I just want <coughs> to put that tree back first of all so this is where they are going to be living in Oasis Springs and this is the lovely little house that they have so they have this back area which is all decked out for them to grill and sit around a fire pit the kids have some toys out here that they can play with and when you go in the front door as you can see there's just a hall that goes straight to the back end but if you go to the left here there is the kids room here and it is a shared bedroom with a child and a toddler as you can see this is the one bathroom in the house this is the parents room and then we have the little living room and their kitchen so it is a small little tiny house but it has everything that this little family needs and so I do want to go ahead and introduce you to this family so I am going to go ahead and go into cast and show you our characters so do know that this um, challenge that I am going to be doing is going to be only probably ran once or twice a month so I'll only upload once or twice a month for this um, but the single sim challenge is a challenge that is on um, like if you google it under the sims challenges and I will go over those rules with you let me just pull them up but first and foremost I want you to meet the family so first we have Luke Godwin and he is the father so this is what he looks like cute and his aspiration is friend of the world he is family oriented a vegetarian and a music lover and i'll just quickly take you through his outfits and his wife is esmeralda rivera And this sim actually was made by um, Lady Simmer and I just downloaded her because I think she's absolutely gorgeous and I was like you know what I am gonna make her a uh, part of this series and I just redid her hair but this sim was created by Lady Simmer and her aspiration is freelance botanist she is cheerful she is clumsy and she is a bookworm and as you can see she is a spellcaster and these are her outfits and then we have Juliet Godwin And her aspiration is to be a whiz kid and her unfortunately her trait is that she's joyless so it says about joyless these sims haven't experienced feelings of joy for a long period of time trigger warning this may or may not be related to persistent depressive disorder so she is a depressed sim she has no joy although she was just smiling but these are her outfits. And then we have little Amira. And this is what she looks like. Oh, and we missed some eyelashes. That just won't do. There we go. Lovely. So this is what she looks like. I think she's absolutely precious. And her outfits. Mm. 
<laughs> so she is super adorable. And her trait is that she is bouncy. And it says, these toddlers are very playful and energetic. They build movement skill quickly. They become energized when using the skill and regain fun need from it. So she's going to be a ball of fun. So as you can see, this is our lovely family here. Our Godwin family. And so let's go ahead and go over the rules. So in this challenge, it's your task to control only one sim from toddler to elder. You will have to play as if you cannot control anyone else in the household. You may do anything in your sim's life, but the task must be complete before aging up. So you can complete the task in any order and the age span should be set to long. So before starting the challenge, you have to create a family. So that's what I've done two parents, a child, and then yourself as the toddler. You need to move into a home worth under 40,000, which I have already done. The house that I picked them and plopped them in was less than 40,000. And then it says to get the parents jobs. So I do need to do that. I'm gonna go ahead and just hop in here with them really quick and we can see them in their native setting. And I go ahead and give them their jobs. So for, for Luke here, he wants to be a friend of the world. And then she is a freelance botanist. So I'm probably going to make her a gardener and him. I don't really know. Friend of the world. We'll have to figure that out. So we'll get them a job and then it does say to go ahead and cheat them up to level two of that profession. Um, once you begin the challenge, you're not allowed to make any changes other than changing their hair or clothes and casts can be made to the family. So the only other change you could have is if like you needed to reset a sim, but literally the only person that I can control is going to be Amira because she is the toddler. So I'll have to get Amira from toddler to elder without controlling anyone else. So never clicking on anyone else. The only time that I can control and one of the adults in the family would be to pay bills, repair objects, clean, um, or you can hire a maid at this present moment here before you get started, feed and bathing pets, putting out fires and making birthday cakes. So everything else is to not be done. So there are tasks as far as for each life stage. And as a toddler, um, I have to ask the parents for everything. So I have to ask for meals, baths, pottying, learning how to walk, talk, and more. And I am totally dependent on my parents. The tasks for me are to master the potty, become good friends with both of the parents, and then to master at least two toddler skills. So I have to do all of those things while I am a toddler. So we'll leave it there. Now I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you are notified when the new episode goes live and I will see you guys in the next single sim challenge with the Godwin family. Bye y'all.